Well, the Knicks this season, when they've had the lead entering the fourth quarter, are undefeated. They've got a golden opportunity to keep that undefeated, but the Nets much better here in the second half shooting the ball. Well, that one way off the mark. Quickly. Gibson sets the screen, quickly finds some room, nails a three, rattles it. R.J. Barrett, who picked up that last foul, now backing in against Dinwiddie. Barrett, using his strength, forced that one up. Royce O'Neal fires away. Josh Hart. Well, Hart got hit. It's 7 a.m. when he said it was peaceful and quiet on the bridges. That's including shooting and pickup games and all the other lifting and working out that he's doing. So no wonder he's in such great shape. Imagine watching 6'9 Taj running over the bridge on your morning commute, guys. Well, that would be quite the sight. But he's always taking care of his body. Meanwhile, that's one of the nicest plays we've seen all to just every single night be able to keep his body in balance and lace him up and be available for his team. And oh, by the way, big time production as he makes that second free throw. He's averaging over 20 a game. He's become a really, really cornerstone piece for these nets. Ball deflected out. They always say that first game back, and both these teams were out west a long time. And they're always interesting to see. Finney Smith lines that one up. That one way off gives him the rebound. And specifically, Mike, the first quarter is the tough quarter because you're kind of, oh, there's a back quarter. That was a yeah, close call. Taj Gibson was momentarily. Back up top to Bridges. Cam Johnson. Finney Smith drives. And a whistle and a foul. So Finney Smith being convicted and found guilty and sentenced to 44 years. The man who actually shot the gun accepted a plea deal and got out in five years. It's wow. just so Finney Smith has been waiting for this day for the longest time. He took his wife and his kids and met they met their grandfather for the first time. And he saw his father for the first time in person in 29 years. He said it was the greatest Christmas gift he could ever imagine. That is a powerful story. Holy cow. He just, you can't even imagine the emotion on both ends. Yeah. Grimes makes the move, can't finish the tip. He had an impact on so many young kids when he was doing that. And, and while you know this better than anybody, the youth coaches, what they do to, to build the foundation for a young basketball player can be incredible. Yeah, and the Island Garden is a great place to do it. It's a great AAU system that comes out of there. It's where I played a lot of my summer league games. It's a beautiful facility. Josh Hart, they were on sharp as well. 5.43 remaining. Knicks right now in control. Well, still plenty of time. Hart, nine points, season high, 12 rebounds. He is, for somebody his size, he's as good a rebounder at his size as anybody in the NBA. Yeah, and it's, impo five. it's important for him to rebound with the with no Mitchell Robinson for these weeks. And he is willing to get in there and get banged around and do whatever it takes to help this team win. Rebounding is a big part of it. That shot is good. With the Statue of Liberty poster. No messing around laying that one up. That was a one-handed hammer. Brunson floats it up and in, gets knocked down. Brunson 14 points, but he has eight assists. To go along with six rebounds. Make it seven rebounds. Manual quickly. Scampers back outside. Josh Hart inside to Randall. Quick move from Randall. A couple of head fakes. Up and in and banks it home. Julius Randall 20.